Welcome everyone to this fifth episode in the series on impromptu speaking, a series based on my book, Impromptu. As I've discussed in the previous two videos, an impromptu script begins with a grabber and then with a message. The third component, which I'll discuss now, forms the body of your script. It's the proof points. Your proof points develop your message. Once you have your message, ask yourself, how can I prove it? Choose two to four points that support your message. There are many ways to structure your proof points, but one way is to give reasons with the keywords first, second, and third. Let's say a boss gives you a new project and your message is, it sounds like a great opportunity for my team. Your proof points might be the following three reasons you see it as an opportunity. First, it will give us visibility in the company. Second, it will allow us to create something very special. And third, it will give me the leadership role I've long wanted. Another pattern for organizing your proof points would be problem and solution. For example, if you're asked in a job interview, tell me about a problem you solved. Your proof points might be, the problem was software, the solution was the team. There are other patterns you can use and you'll find them in my book. The important thing to remember from this video is to have a structure that supports and proves your message. I'll discuss the last component of an impromptu script in the next video.